welcome to Review Out. Um, I'm back at it again. He says, uh, finally, got a bit of spare time. Um, I'm in the shop at the moment. So I may, we may get customers, we know, if we may get interrupted. But that's part and parcel of it, you know. Got my dog down here at the side of me. And he's always about. But we're back at it again doing this. Um, Lithuanian, this Lithuanian MRE. I, um, I don't remember if I did one previously on the channel and they sent me out another one because it was damaged, which I thought was really good of them. And uh, so I, I said I'd actually do a, another review when I got one again. So we can, we can speed through this one a little bit because we've already got the same thing. So let's have a look and see what we've got. So for the background noise, that's the kettle boiling. We're doing that because uh, we may need to add you know, for like the coffee or condiments and stuff like that. So we've got here some fire starters, matches, wipe and a spoon. Keep forgetting about these fire starters. I should be using them to light the coal fire. That's, you know. Oh, a cable tie as well. No cable tie for you uh, to, to zip it all up at the end. Possibly. So there we go. So there's that bag done. We've got some biscuits, we've got some hazelnuts, that's my stove, that's my tray for heating. So we just turn the kettle off, it keeps on constantly boiling and fills us up full of steam. Come on Bruce, stop the way. So we have, let's get into this one, this is this condiment bag. And um, we'll see what we've got going on here. Okay, so we've got some honey. That'll be for the crackers. So this will be my starting course, I dare say, honey. Uh, we've got some chocolates, the pudding, instant coffee, uh, sugar, which I don't use. And um, what is this? It is a orange flavored instant drink. So, that tells us what we've got in the meal variety. variety. So we're not gonna cook it with that one. We'll possibly warm it up in the, uh, hot bowl method of hot water. I think that works quite well. I mean, you can eat these cold as well, can't you? So depending on what the meal is, we'll see. Or you could even have a bag one, who knows. Oh, it's got the bag one, so we can cook it in the bag. Cook it in the bag. Cook it in the bag. Right, so, does it tell me what we've got? No idea. No idea what's in here. But it's 240 gram of something. And it was made Fuck knows. Don't even know if it's in there. But we'll find it says 30 the 11th, 2018. So whether that's its expiry date or when it was made, I don't know. I think it's expiry date, I think it'll let it sat there longer. Feels a bit solid in there, but we'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. It's, this one's not pierced, so hey. Right, so let's make these. Uh, let's, make, let's get this going. Instant coffee. There's lots of action going around here. Lots of people moving about. Neighbors. Food delivery vans. Right. This is like a. This is a. This, I'm a proper, not a coffee snob, but I like my coffee. When I'm resorted to this, but this is the experiment, guys. So, let me just get some uh, water for this. Yeah, so there's the coffee done. Let me get some. Uh, Cold water in this for the orange, the orange flavoured drink. Might as well stir it into it, haven't we? Right, okay, so there. Uh, I've got extra spoons. So I'm going to use this. I suppose you could use it all the way through, but I mean, are you supposed to use this as a knife as well for spearing your honey onto it, or do you dip your honey biscuits into it? Who knows? Orange drink. Oh, it smells good. 
it smells, it does smell that powdery dry stuff though. That, that, that smell. Food colouring, yes. Right, get that in there. So this will have all like the electrolytes in it and stuff and all your minerals and stuff you need for when you're on the move. And your one pack meal ration. This isn't, this isn't a 24 hour one, I don't think it's breakfast or anything. Like I said, I have no idea what's in here. I hope I like it. So we've got his uh, drinks. It takes a bit of stir in that. Try and get that dissolved. No point having instructions I can't read. So we've got the food bag. Uh, da -da 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 -da. We need 60 ml of water to the sleeve. So, we take said food pouch and put it in. Can't get in. Can't get in. Can't get into it. What's going on here? Get the scissors. Been beaten by a seal pack, guys. Oh, 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 seal pack. Yeah, hopefully that will get us in now. Here we go, magic. So, like so. Like so. So this is 12 minutes you've got to go for. Right, so let's get 60 ml of water. I've got a measuring jug and everything, guys. The world's most exciting MRE video, <laughs> part two. I'm halfway through doing another one as well, but I've just not had the time to get back into it. And I'm doing this one instead. And uh, that's the way it is, guys. So basically it says here, you see what I've done so far. I'll rip the top off, put the bag in, put the 60 ml of water in, uh, fold the sleeve over, heat. It's under the meal, and uh, it's how we indicated to take the meal out after 12 minutes. Right, so let's get this 60 mil in here. Right, okay. And it's giving us a bit of sticky for it. So, there, that's that closed. Let's give that a a shake and now well guys we can watch this now kick off right, let me put this over there and you can watch this whilst it's cooking so that's that's my main meal right give this another stir don't know if you remember the last time watching one of these go it was quite good fun a friend of mine who watched the video said that was one of the best bits <laughs> Right, so let's try this. There you are, she's not too sweet. All right. Let's try the instant coffee. Yeah, that's dank. But it's coffee, I suppose. If you were, you know, out there doing it, adding the sugar to it, it must have been making it a bit better. We don't need the jug here anymore. Yeah. 12 minutes, what time are we on now? Right. So four minutes past. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. So, I have bought an knife with me as well. So we can have some honey crackers.
So it is quite dense. We're on about this last time, weren't we? So I'm only going to eat one of them, guys. Just so we can see what it's like. I think I had a different jam last time. I think I had a, an apricot or a fruit jam. And this time we've got honey, which is uh, nice. And it's uh, crystallised honey. It's not runny honey anymore. It's crystallised. Um, that'll be just to its, just to its age, but it smells all right. Nope. It's pretty solid, guys. We'll comprise a bit out. Proper. No, it's solid all the way through, but you know. When in Rome, somebody commented on the last video, I said you could have tried it. Well, I didn't like trying to look at that other thing, but we'll try this. Yeah, it's just rock hard, doesn't it? Just taste the sweetness. Oh, it's on it, look. It's doing it. So, yeah. Cooking guys. So yeah, I'm not gonna very uh very compressed biscuits. Bubbling like you're in there. So what else do we got? We've got some hazelnuts. Oh, I love nuts. Nuts are just nuts though, aren't they guys? You know. <laughs> Cause, can you see me? Oh, a couple of hazelnuts. Mmm. Good sauce of protein. Oils and... calories and stuff like that. Which is what you're going to need if you're out with these. We're currently having like minus 10 at night and stuff and it's not getting above really freezing through the day at the moment. So, so if it was outside, you know, this would be nice. You have a little, little stove as well to make your brew. And heat anything else that you wanted to heat. Yeah, good then. Oh yeah. You know, so you could whilst this is cooking, make your brew. I presume if this was more in date. Yeah, best before the twenty seventh of the night, two thousand and eighteen. So it's fair to say the whole that that was correct then. On the uh out of date on the eleventh of the eighth. But we're still gonna eat it. It's uh wasn't you know Seven or eight. The stuff of legends. Let's see if there were a date on these as well, but you know. Oh my god, there's some real stuff in here. But we don't we can't see the date on this. But these are out. No we don't, yeah. 10th of the 5th, 2019, so these are actually still in date, but they're just rock hard biscuits. Rock hard. So we're going to let this cook. We've got some chocolate, let's see. Last time we, uh, we opened some of this chocolate, it was oxidised as well, so uh, who knows? Maybe this might be alright. Survival scissors. Yeah, that's alright. Well, slight oxidisation, but nothing much, you know. Nice bit of chocolate. 
slight powdery thing to it. Because then this is dark chocolate. Yep. There we go. Come back with some hazelnut. Mmm. That's a lot better. Mmm. No. Put too many at once. chocolate and the nuts really works well together and it's not a bad quality chocolate either it's uh it's survived better than the honey <laughs> so this is nearly finishing up because i have no idea what it is if, um, it was sent to me and it, i can't like i said i can't tell what the recipe is so if it's going to be something like beans and sausage and beans, it's going to really gank me out because I'm not into beans. Not baked beans. I don't like sauce, I don't like any of it. Never went by But I suppose if you're hungry, you'd eat it. I'd chuckle it in. But. Right, well, we'll just pause it there a minute, guys. Might as well let this finish up. Let this finish heating up, it's got another few more minutes. We were five minutes yet. So, I'll be back then. Right guys, so we've packed time's past. I've, I've tidied up the counter a little bit. Still got some chocolate. I have noticed I was eating a few more of these nuts. There's the odd one. That was quite tough to chew, you know, they're looking a bit shrunken and stuff. That one was quite hard. But, still, very eatable. So yeah. So basically now we just say, um, after so many minutes, blah, 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 we then open meal, said meal container. Excuse me. Uh, uh. They're really quite hot then. Eh? I'm going to leave them on the side to cool down. I'm not going to put them in the bin. You never know. You never know. Hey. Please don't be beans. Please don't be beans. Please don't be beans. Ooh. Ooh. Looks like some sort of uh, stew. That looks a bit... Rubbery, that, oh, well, that's rice, I think. Is it rice? I don't know. So if you can see all that, guys, plenty of uh, meat in there, whatever meat it is, and this is like, I presume, rice. Yeah, it looks like rice. Let's give it a whirl. Salty, not a lot uh, overly salty, but it's got season. I presume it's chicken, which is all right, you know. Quite happily eat this on a cold day. Right, let's try and work out what this bit is. It could be mash. No, it's rice. Rice, but like mash. Very solid, though. I mean, all in all, very good. So, if you remember the look of the last one, I presume it was the same one. 
other than the choice of from jam to honey. But the food looked a lot different. It looked at all this rice stuff looked a, like a bit darker. And that is just that is just solid. Yeah, tofu or something solid. How do you like your rice? Solid. But yeah. All in all, guys. Hey, you got them. And a big thanks to the eBay sellers for sending me back out so I could complete my review. That that is very good. It's um. You know, those, some of these kits you get things like hot sauce and stuff like that, and depending on where the MRE comes from, and that would have worked really well with that, some nice hot sauce. So we'll finish off with a cheap coffee. Yeah, like that, eatable. So as I finish up eating this, guys. I'm going to go and edit this up and get it online. Um, and hopefully more things to review in the future. Peace out, guys.